come on Ben. Good morning everybody. Tuesday morning. You won't be able to see me. It's pitch black. It snowed. And I'm trying to drag the bin down a snowy road. Oh, that bin was heavy. I'll tell you what, this place in the bin once a fortnight is ridiculous. Uh, I've gone to ice the car. Nice crisp layer of snow. Here we'll get the car warmed up. Yeah, good Tuesday morning everybody. Oh. Can't be bothered this morning, but you got to earn the money to do what you want to do. So, I'll speak to you shortly. Moving on. Yeah, good Tuesday morning, everybody. Good news is I'm feeling a lot better this morning. I was quite ill for the last few days. Headaches gone. Ready to take on the snowy day. Waiting for Michelle. But, car's nice and warm. Moving on. Hi guys, that's ne us nearly at work. Now we just heard a funny story on the radio. Some poor farmer in Aberdeenshire is going to be forever known as Tiger Farm. Apparently the police put up on their website or their social media sites that they responded to a 999 call. When was it last night? A couple of nights ago. A couple of nights ago they responded to a 999 call. A farmer had phoned up to say there's a tiger on his farm. In his barn, yeah. His barn, yeah. Oh, um, and obviously, did you get seriously pleased? They all uh, scrambled. <laughs> Arm response. Arm response. Oh dog handlers. And when they got to the farm, they found it was a stuffed toy. A life-sized stuffed a life toy. Stuff. And it was it was Saturday night, so. Yeah. So. Poor farmer. All them placed there, and they opened it up. I can just I can just imagine it, you know, SWAT team going in to tackle a live a, tiger, a, a cuddly toy. <laughs> yeah, poor guy's never going to live that down. Uh, what I want to know is if he's not usually got a a cuddly toy in his barn, where the hell did it come from? <sighs> Excuse me, while I get past this cyclist. So, yes, definitely won't be able to live that one down. Anyway, I'm nearly at work now. Tuesday, nearly at work. Journey wasn't too bad. Uh, maybe lost a minute with the weather, which is surprising because there was a lot of traffic out this morning. Looked like everybody set out early for the snow, which is non existent around here. Oh, anyway, let's get into work. Start the working day, see what's going to be brought, bring, and that's going to be the first two working days over with. The worst ones. And it always, Wednesday always feels like we get, we're, we're getting there. Anyway, I definitely waffle, so moving on. Hi guys, that's the working day over with. We're on our way home. We're um, amazed at how light it is. We're nearly home actually. It's about past five now. There is daylight in the place. I don't know how it's coming out on the camera, but it's just about twilight now, so yay. And that forecast snow is not hitting us, is it? Uh, it did snow slightly today, but yeah. it's supposed to snow again on Saturday. Saturday we can live with. I don't think we've got anything, we've got nothing on on Saturday, so go us. So it's off home now to watch documentaries, isn't it? Are you watching that documentary? I, I've got it on record, so I don't have to watch it today. Right. Documentary about the Jamie uh, the Bulger killers, Jimmy Bulger killers. So because Michelle likes doing research. You must have you must be a world expert now. I don't think so. You must have at least have a plan formulation of a plan of how you're going to pump me off. You can't get away with it these days. Oh, that's what's saving me. Self preservation. Pause. Anyway, moving on. 
Good ridiculous o'clock in the morning, guys. It's 5.16. Heading off to work early. Got a little bit of work to do early. First early doors, so early start this morning. And unfortunately, because we share lifts. So do I. Yes, we've got to go to work. Two and a half hours before Michelle gets to work. Gets to go to work, usually, normally. Starts work even. Hi, Waffle. You can tell it's early morning. I don't know how I'm going to do reasonable work at this time, but let's get going. Moving on. Wednesday morning. Hump day. Hi, guys. We've just walked out the door and the heating just kicked off in the house. How disappointing is that? Bad timing. The heat's in the house and we're off to work. Or I'm off to work. You're off to set my car for an hour and a half, aren't you? Moving on. Okay guys, we set out early and then run out of petrol. So, instead of having a, oh, we've got plenty of time to get to work, we've just made it to work, for me. Obviously, I'm an hour and a half early. Earlier than normal. I'm not actually early, because this is the time I need to start today. Oh. It just gives me a little bit of time to get my stuff printed off before I go into the meetings. Okay. Meet up with night shift, here I come. Swap over to Michelle, this will happen. And Michelle's gonna go and sit on a car park for an half an hour. So, aren't you? Moving on. Hi guys, that's the working day over with. Halfway through the working week, gone. Gone and done. Now, trying to get off this car park, just nipped at co-op for a couple of things. Now, the, the headache has transferred from me to Michelle. I haven't got a headache anymore, but Michelle has. Mm. So, probably something to go in around. Hopefully I don't get it again. It's a really good place back. Hopefully I don't get it back, but yeah, we're on our way home now. Um, thank God that day is over with. A long day. Because what, I don't know if I said this morning, we set out early, didn't we? Mm -hmm. I can't remember if you said or not. Yeah. Oh, should have gone. Now we're stuck in this junction. Forever. Not. Even winds than it didn't get me out. Anyway, we're off home to have a curry. curry. Homemade curry tonight. Moving on. Okay, guys, we're watching a program about things that went on in the past. Now, I remember going around to my grandma's house, and that's how she used to wash with a dolly tub. She didn't do that though. They're actually fighting with a dolly tub and a mangle. Okay. So is that one we'll what go get up the rack? Yeah, it's very little meat and rabbit. Can we do that now, guys? What? Physical labour after being down mill. Mm -hmm. Right, then there'll be meat. And it must have been hard to... Oh, different times. Moving on. Okay, guys, we've just been watching... What was it? Back in Time for Tea. Back in Time for Tea. Started in 1918 and ran up to 1939, didn't it? it did. In this episode. And it was good. Yeah, I enjoyed that. Did you like? That's completely stumped me. I don't know what to say. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was really good. There was some good stuff in there, especially how many tribe shops were there in Manchester? Over two hundred. Yeah. Has anybody ever had tribe? My dad used to eat it, and I tasted it, and I refused to eat it ever again. It's disgusting. They were playing football with the pig's bladder. They were. Working out mill. Doubt mill. Out doubt bait and up mill. In the cotton mills. From fourteen year old. Mm -hmm. Yeah. With a fourteen hour day. Fourteen twelve hour shifts or whatever they did. Anyway, with that you can see that uh, we both oh excuse me, a little bit tired and yawning. And it's uh, back at nine. So we're going to call it on a vlog now. And we're going to go off to bed. And do it all again tomorrow. Thursday tomorrow. Friday Eve tomorrow. 
downhill from here. Is your headache? It's better actually. I haven't. It hasn't been hurting since. So you don't need pills now. No, I'm fine. Huh, that's good news. So the headache I passed on, but that's how I I was. I was all right. For, uh, I thought, oh great, got up in the morning. Ugh. Yeah, just saps your energy, doesn't it? Oh, so I've got that to look forward to the end. Yeah. I had to put up with it, and so did you. So keep it to yourself. <laughs> anyway, with that, before I get thumped, it's a good night from me. <laughs> it's a good night from him. Good night, see you all in the morning.